Welcome back. In the previous part, we arrived here in Crossbell, and we got a few requests to go through here, but first we need to see about Kia, who is apparently upstairs. So let's start doing the rounds. Ooh, look at that fancy chair. Was that there last time? That nice blue padding. I did notice this during the cutscene previously. The texture of the wood above the door seems broken here. Like, it's slightly off. How do I know it's slightly off? Because it's completely fine over here. It's like, huh. That's, that seems something that would be a Falcom issue, not a Geofront issue. Like misaligned textures and stuff like that. They can only duplicate the, the texture and make a high-res version, all that type of stuff. At its placement, I don't know about that. I don't know if they could change that. Boxes! My god! So beautiful. No, second floor, apparently. Anything to comment on in here? Look at the size of that speaker system. Orbal speaker system. This is Randy's room. He's taking part in the Belgard unit's rehabilitation training right now. My memory served me right. They were given some of that drug during the court incident, right? Right. They didn't suffer from any serious after effects, thankfully. It'll take some time to recover their stamina and senses, though. I see. Well, I'm wishing all the guardsmen a speedy recovery. I'm looking forward to him coming home, too. Welcome to my castle. How do you like it? Color scheme's a bit... dark. It's very, very, very sort of like... dark blues and greys. And this is one stylish room. Although, also there's a map of Earth over there. Seriously, it's almost like something you'd see in a model home. Although I say there's a map of Earth, it does actually look quite different, doesn't it? Like, Australia is completely off, like, way off. Why have a look at that map? It didn't take you any time to get settled in, did it? The furniture looks rather expensive, too. I asked an acquaintance of mine for a favour, and he hooked me up. If you guys ever get tired, I don't mind you coming in to relax. Since we're here, how about I crack open that bottle over there to celebrate a successful move-in? How about we don't? Us? Duty? Still on it? True, 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 true. Like that? Like, normally if they use, like, maps of Earth, in this game, they, they match up with Earth, but that one is like, the land masses are roughly right? It's, it's like a... Like an Earth from like, say, millions of years ago, and it was still coming into its current configuration in terms of continents. Because it, it's just like, Madagascar is huge there. Like, massively huge, and Australia is way off. Don't know what's going on with Europe, either, but it's like, it's roughly... Rough, very roughly Earth, but it's like, huh. Can we steal a bottle? Nope. It's worth trying. Alright, where's Kia? She'll be at the end, won't she? Anything to say about this room? Nope. And this is Tia's room. She's still taking care of work out in Le Mans State, right? Yeah, she's at the Epstein Foundation Research Lab with Jonah. Via state laws have made it easier to expand the orbital network, so they're assisting the Foundation with that. Most of that flew right over my head, but it sounds like the Foundation must keep them busy. I hope she can come back soon. So do I. Welcome to my room. Let's have a look, let's have a look. I like it, there's the bear! I didn't decorate much, so this is a little embarrassing. Still rather tidy, I'd say. Like, yeah, it's quite tidy. Like, you've even got, like, a cube system for your... Um... Sideboard? Like, the thing on the right. Indeed, exactly what I would expect of someone like Noel. Oh, that plush over there. <laughs> That's a matching plush Fran and I have. I know. I brought it with me from the CGF's barracks. Really? I think it kind of pulls the room together. I'll take that as a compliment. 
I'm still not entirely adjusted yet, but it's got to be here. Indeed. I, I, I thought this was wood then. It's like, no, it's a carpet, isn't it? She's adorable. Kia? She's so cute! Don't you have Sunday school today? Shouldn't you be off by now? Oh, yeah. I guess it's about time to meet the others. Are you all going to work? Uh-huh. We could all leave together if you want. Oh, were you studying ahead of Sunday school? <laughs> yep. You're such a good girl, Kia. I only did what was required at Sunday school. I don't think I ever did any extra studying. I hardly ever showed up, to be honest. I figured it made more sense to teach myself than to be taught by some incompetent priest. I wish you wouldn't set a bad example for Kia. Hmm? <laughs> I think I upset Mama Bear and Papa Bear. Wait. Triple dot. Was he? Is something wrong? I was just thinking how progressive Crossbell is. More importantly, shouldn't we be going? Yeah. Are you coming with us, Kia? Yep. Give me one sec. What? Why, what was that about, Wazzy? All right, all set. He's got, he's got a little back. Okay, let's go. He's got a little back. He's adorable. Let's take Kia out the back exit, shall we? I thought it was closed off. What the, what there was stuff going on there? The penguin buck! Penguins! Last time I saw you was in Neuta. And how did he get there? Hmm? 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 Hey, Zayt and Gobby. Hanging out together? You two do get along. This is the police dog the SSS adopted, right? Good to see you again, Zite. <laughs> adopted is not the correct word. I'm the one looking after them. <laughs> My mistake. Well, Truey does help us out fairly often. He's a proud pup, that's for sure. I've never been good with dogs, but I managed to get used to Zite. And who is this black cat? Oh, his name is Copper. We're pretty sure he's been here since before the CNS moved out. It's been a while. How have you been? Ah, oh, how cute. I didn't think I'd be getting my own cat too when I joined the SSS. Are you a fan of cats, Noel? I'm sure you're going to have plenty of fun. Um, yeah. That was a yawn. Oh, yeah, we should feed Copper. What's wrong? Actually, I think he's full now. The chief must have fed him before he left. Oh, that's a bit of a shame. Don't worry, Noel. We can bring him some fish next time we catch them. I, I, I don't think that's on my list. Let me, let me just double check. And the closest is an expression of delight. Oh, yeah, that actually does... Yeah, expression of delight. So, yeah, I'll mark that down. I need to make another video about the... Um, can you talk for dummies in the future? Err. Uh, is something wrong? Woof. Not at all, he says. Oh, okay. Look after the SSS building for us, okay? We're leaving, Zite. Woof. Grr. Grr, indeed. Alright, so you said back exit, so let's see about that first. Because I do want to know what's going on here. Wait a second. When did this happen? Huh? Was the rear entrance always like this? Did someone order some renovations to be done? Oh yeah, you guys weren't here. While you were on your trip, some construction workers came by. I guess the chief caught them in. Oh really? 
I didn't notice yesterday. I know what the chief's up to. So do I. Maybe the construction has something to do with how he was acting earlier. Either way, I don't think we should try leaving this way. Yeah, let's go take the exit downstairs. It's clearly going to be some kind of vehicles. Because they're also fixing the stairs. So they've been turned into a ramp rather than stairs. That's, it's it's got to be that. It's got to be. Lovely, lovely bins there. How lovely. Right into the shop. Hey there, special support section. Sergey told me you know, all is starting back up again. Huh? I'll see the redhead or the kid with the opal staff with you. Those two still have some business they're taking care of. Ah, okay. And these two must be your newest members. Sergei filled me in on your weaponry. Let's see if there's anything you like. You've got new stock just for us. How considerate. Thank you very much, sir. Alright, let's have a look at the shop, see if there's anything we can get. Yes, that, that, that seems... better already. So let's... Buy that. Thank you. Yeah, and same, same again. Yes. Fine. It's expecting like, do you want to equip it? Like, yes, I do. Let's get two of them. Star Trek and boots. Okay, anything interesting here, like evasion or something like that? Got more range. I think we're okay. Though nothing like raises the stats, so it's fine. Let's equip here. Lovely. Nope. I wanted to come back back up there. I've got all the weapons you could ever need. Come take a look. Is that really all you got to say? I've got all the weapons you could ever need. Come take a look. All right then. I'm liking this music. Very relaxing. Hey! Kia! Hmm, <laughs> there they are. Hey! Are you an Anri? You're late. We're waiting for you in front of the bakery. Come on, class is about to begin. Hmm, <laughs> sorry you guys. Hey there, are you an Anri? You're as energetic as ever. I'm glad to see you all. Good friends with Kia. Oh, long time no see. <laughs> it's been a while. Kid told me about it already. You're starting the SSL again, right? Yeah, thankfully. We're revamping a few things, so you better look forward to it. <laughs> Listen to you talk. Yeah, well, I, I, I guess the way you are, you're almost as good as braces now. Come on, Ryu. Why do you always have to be so rude? <laughs> Can't say I'm surprised the SSS is popular with kids, too. Oh, you two over there. New faces. Oh, and actually, I don't see Tio or Randy anywhere, either. They're busy taking care of some unfinished business right now. These two are Noel and Wesley, the newest members of the SSS. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. Hold on a sec. Is ever want a guy or a girl? This is kind of girly. Are you? <laughs> I wonder. If you think I'm a girl, then maybe I am. Like, boy? Come on, Wesley, stop trying to confuse the kids. And more importantly, shouldn't the three of you get along already? Oh, yeah. See you later, everyone. Good luck with back. Good luck to you too, Kia. Watch out for cars, okay? Uh-huh. Cool. Let's go to Momo's place. Yeah, we need to hurry. <laughs> oh, to be a kid again. He from Westry. Oh, I like that again. Like, it's, it's... 
a geofront, just like there, the Heath from Westry. It's like, it's such a... Like, the grammar's wrong, but it's correctly wrong. That makes sense. Like, it doesn't have the, is he from Westry, is he from Westry. It's like, it's cut it out. It's like, it's this. This is why I like Geofront, because it's like, that's not a mistake, that's clearly on purpose. And it's such like an offhand way people speak. So it feels natural. That's, that's the kind of quality you get with Geofront. That's the kind of quality. Yeah, the other one's from the residential district there. Anyway, let's get to work. Let's start by going to Genton and headquarters. Good idea to do a once over at the city too. Oh, like a patrol, right? No, we call it the rounds, Noel. Yeah, but it's not that strict. Now to talk to people around the city. Sometimes we receive unexpected info or find people who need our help. The chief should call us on my Enigma sometime later. Let's go check out the city while we're waiting. Roger. Lloyd. Fine with me. Chapter 1. Ominous Days. Well, that's ominous. The Crossbell City map can now be opened. While inside the city, press the R thing to bring up a map of the city. Press R again for a map of the state. If you're inside the city, you can use the map as a shortcut to travel around quickly. Hmm. You can fast travel to areas listed on the left side of the screen. I might change that button. Be aware that in some situations, fast travel will be unavailable. Because it's like I'm not using my right trigger for anything. It's like I could have that as the map rather than that. Hmm. Anyway. Oh! It's Zoid and Ellie. Oh, and... Huh? Where are Tia and Randy? Is the special support section still on vacation? Uh, not exactly, Mimi. Randy and Tia are still busy with other work they have to do. That's right. These are the newest members of the SSS. Oh, really? So, now you're the new special support section. He's not wrong. Nice to meet you, Mimi. Aha, uh -huh, nice to meet you too. Mimi. Go, go, new special support section. Lovely. I saw an orbital car flying through Central Square earlier. They have flying cars already? They were clearly speeding, so I immediately reported them to the police. I wonder if they caught the driver, though. I I'm worried it'll happen again. Although, with current traffic laws, they'd just get slapped with a fine and be on their merry way if they got caught. The Diet has been making strides recently in strengthening penalties for breaking traffic laws. That gives me hope for the future. All the corrupt members of the Republican and Imperial factions that were involved with the cult incident are gone. Even Ravarch is out too. Yet the status quo remains the same. The Imperial faction still has an edge when it comes to Diet seats. I've heard about Mayor Croy's strenuous efforts to speed up legal reforms, but he still has a long, long road ahead of him. What was the name of that other group? Hi, 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 hey, hi, hi, you, hi. Anyway, with Ravarch gone, I've heard that they've started to exert their influence. Mayor Croy still has a long, long road ahead of him. Hopefully, he can enact laws that'll allow us citizens to live in peace. Sir, Peef, yeah, in Peef. Oh, hello. The decor in the restaurant is plain, but the food is a completely different story. <laughs> I really like it. Yeah, and the prices are fair. I could get used to this. Right, you're a tourist, so we'll just leave you at one check. Flotte is one of our regulars. It's pretty common for her to come in right at opening and sit here for the entire day. She's considerate enough to order throughout the entire day. Give up her seat during peak hours, unfortunately. Unfortunately, fortunately. It's pretty common for her to come in right at opening and sit here for the entire day. Considerate enough, fortunately. One thing I'm thinking, by the way, because my plan to go back through Cold Steel 3 and not do the NPC is just, like, fly through, 
so we can get to Cold Steel 4 very quickly. I'm thinking though, there's a certain point in that game that I actually do want to do NPCs. I'll leave it up to you if you can figure out why I want to do that. Sip sip. Phew, this restaurant is the perfect place to read a good book. There's very little noise and easy access to coffee to perk you up. Blech. Now then, I think I'll finish this book I borrowed from the library today. Good day, everyone. Welcome to Vincept. Be sure to check out our seasonal options. Would you like to try Braun's newest menu? Maybe. Milk pottage? Hmm, a few of them. A fried fish could be good. Could give it to copy. Maybe. Maybe. Be sure to check out our seasonal options. Is fried fish good for cats? I don't know. I would recommend them. Okay. I asked El Deo to develop his own menu. But it crashed and burned. It's not like he doesn't have the skill, but well... It's going to be a while before he becomes a real chef, if he keeps this up. Not like he doesn't have the skill, but... Well... It's going to be a while before he becomes a real chef if he keeps this up. Hmm... I wonder where exactly my new menu fell short. The flavor and appearance were appealing, and the shocking texture was to die for. Shocking texture? Kind of description doesn't make me want to try it. Just came up with the most brilliant new recipe. Wetlands Monster Ival Stew. Abaddon style. That's one... interesting name. Bet the taste would be as jam-packed as the name. Just, it is sort of like, I kinda wanna try it, but don't at the same time. <laughs> it was nothing, honey. Considering all you take care of at home, it's the least I could do. Thank you for saving me a seat, dear. I love how kind you are to me. Oh, it's, it's lovely to see a couple just getting on like that. It really is. It's like, although I have traumatic memory scare of Anton. Poor Anton. He just completely misread the situation. Poor guy. Poor guy. I wonder where he is. I wonder where he is. Ah, I just remembered that we have Sunday school later. You finish your homework, Bruna. Homework? Ain't nobody got time for that. Ah, Arias is out of town again too. This is like, literally, the worst? It's, it's so good to be here. I failed the entrance exam for St. Ursula Medical College yet again. Oh dear. You know what they say, that time's the charm, right? I, I, yes. They do. I say that. Soon? No, or is it in the past? I think it's in the past from your point of view in Mass Effect. Nope, maybe I'm not cut out for this after all. All my worthless self's good for is fetching the ingredients for tonight's dinner. Uh, what am I doing with my life? If you're looking for fresh ingredients, look no further. Legion's Foods has you covered. Did you know there's a stall that makes healthy juice using our ingredients? Give it a shot sometime. My daughter runs it up the road in the administrative district. Wait, that was new. That was new. If you're in the mood for juice, give the stall in the administrative district a shot. The juice is made using our ingredients. Well, there we go. Thanks for shopping at times. This is the reception desk. Feel free to ask me any questions, and I'll do my best to answer them. Did you see that we opened the rooftop a few days ago? Oh. There are no stars up there, but you can get a really nice view of the city. Feel free to take a look if you'd like. I, I will. Customers were thrilled when we decided to open up the rooftop the other day. Why not go up there and soak in the sights when you need a break? I, I certainly will. Good afternoon. Welcome to Times Department Store. Oh, well, if it isn't Miss Ellie. 
I heard you were traveling to various nations with Speaker McDowell, but it appears you've returned. Just a couple of days ago, as a matter of fact, the special support section has reconvened, so I'll be shopping with you yet again. We're honored to have you. I'll be praying for your success. You're acquainted with the manager, Ellie? Yes, I am. He's known my grandfather for a long time and has always treated us well. Leave it to the speaker's granddaughter. You're going to hook us all up, right, Mr. Manager? We're here teammates, after all. It's only fair we get the VIP treatment as well. Unfortunately not. Neither you nor Miss Ellie will be receiving special treatment. We'll treat your group the same as we would any other customer. Sorry, Wazzy, but no special treatment for you. Ah, there go my free samples. You get a salary for a reason. Allow me to express my gratitude for visiting Times today. Our fine establishment boasts many different stores to attract your attention. Hope you'll take your time and browse them. I shall. <gasps> Mishies! Wow, they really do have a Mishy corner at the general goods store. I gotta make the most of this opportunity. Hello, welcome to Southwark General Store. I've been stocking up on more Mishy related merchandise lately to meet customer demand. Feel free to take a look. Mishy merchandise, eh? Bet Tia will be ecstatic. Undoubtedly. Our Mishy merchandise is incredibly popular with the customers. Feel free to take a look. Thank you, Wonder. Crossbow Times, number one. I'll have to do that at some point. But, you know, that was something disappointing, I'd say, from Niyuta. Is there really any books you could buy? I go window shopping with my mum pretty much every day. I'm used to it, but sheesh, it's so boring. Was there a door here before? That's what I question. It's like, was there actually a door there before? I kind of want to go back and look. Welcome to Luca Boutique. And we offer clothes from a variety of designers that I personally handpicked. Feel free to take a look at them. But this is why I was very much like, we're not doing the cutting yet. Because it's like, things have changed. Things are not in the same place and there's new areas, so it's like we need to check and have a look. Always creepy these t-shirts. Like, like look at it. It's like it's like it's got a face. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever tire of coming to this store, regardless of how often or how long I visit. Do 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 do. Welcome, please take a look around. Our accessories make great gifts, be it for you or someone else. Alright. See, now these might be good. Um, see, there, like that evasion. The Mishy Tails, it's like, I feel like... I'm gonna buy five. I'm gonna buy five. So I wonder, like, can I equip two? Let's see here. That there. Even though like the long barrel would be good, it's like it's a lot of stuff. So it's like, yeah, I kind of want to get Mishy Tails all round at this point. I feel so. I need three more. Obviously, I'll be changing that in future, but right now, I feel that's a good decision. I have to say, I'm impressed by Mayor Croy and Speaker McDowell. Especially McDowell, he's almost my age, yet he's achieving such great things. <laughs> he must be the shining example of a young man's mind and an old man's body. I suppose he must be the shining example of a young man's mind and young, uh, an old man's body. Speaker McDowell is the star of my generation. Bim, bim, bim. Welcome to Hanson Shoes. If you're having difficulty finding something, I'd be happy to give my assistance. I'd be delighted to assist you in finding the perfect pair of shoes. 
We sell a wide variety of shoes, ranging from casual wear to formal wear, all the way to hiking boots. I'm sure I can assist you in finding the right shoe. Hmm. They are quite good. They are quite good. I forgot to quit them, didn't I? I was just wondering, like, wait, where did I get them from? Cute. Well, that is a nice view, though. It's weird. Weird seeing Crossbell like this. Just... So strange. Time's rooftop, hmm? I never expected them to open such a relaxing spot for us to enjoy. Phew, the wind sure feels nice. Between the view and the cool breeze, I'm glad we came up here. Phew, this place has an amazing view. Oh, uh, I'm not si skipping work, okay? When did you put me in charge of watering the plants? I'll feed you baby's water now. So drink up and grow healthy, okay? What's with the baby talk? Especially with plants, like, what the hell? They're just plants. So where were we? Horse, of course! Do you want a balloon? Feel free to keep one as your touring partner while you look around Crossbell. I promise they're a ton of fun and they'll put you in a good mood. Heck, I'll even give them out to people who aren't tourists. Don't be afraid to speak up if you'd like one. Thank you, Hoss. What the heck is wrong with my dad? Why does he walk around the house naked? I'm a young woman. I'll have you know. I must be committing a crime or three. Uh, I want to live alone already. Only I could buy a nice house somewhere. If only. If only. I want to be careful we speak to over here. Like, we'll avoid you for now. Welcome to Genton Orbel Store. This is the customer service desk. You're Wendy's friend, right? You'll be happy to know. We just received some new Enigma covers. I can also swap your covers for you at this counter free of charge. Don't be shy. I'll switch them out whenever you want. Mirage Element Master Quartz. Enhances EP and ATS. Killing enemies recovers EP. Is this what you want? Yes. Okay, just wait a moment. Here you are. Thanks for waiting. Cool. I look forward to your next visit. Space Elemental Master Quartz that enhances max HP and ADF. Killing enemies recovers HP. Is this what you want? Okay, just wait a moment. Here you are. Thanks for waiting. I look forward to your next visit. So do I. Whose do you want to change? Hmm. Blue Shadow. Oh no, I'm gonna I'll just leave things like that. I do want to talk to you though. You can purchase Enigma covers and Master Quartz or change your covers at this counter. Don't be shy, I'll switch them out whenever you want. Yeah, I'm wondering about changing up things, though. Because that's the case here. It's like, I'm wondering if, like, changing you over to Force could be better for us. Because if she can deal out more damage when she's very AoE, that could be better in the long run for us. But I don't know if I want you to have Shield. Like, maybe... Hmm. Thinking platinum. And for you, you'll have shield though. And for you, I've, I've, although, hmm. What kind of weapons are you guys using? Leather fist. 
Like, he feels very defensive, so it's sort of like... Like with the Tomfas and stuff like that. I mean, they've got plus four defense, so... Critical up with strength. We've got range, it's like... Ooh, kind of want another attack type one. But was he there? Tough choices, tough choices, tough choices. For now, shield is... I think it is probably better that way around. Like, more strength there on that. But you get more shield. Let's put Mirage on you. Because if we look at your weapon... Accuracy goes up. It's like, hmm... What's your ATS there? It's like... Does she have the highest ATS because I just gave her that? Or something else? So that doesn't have a lot of ATS, but still, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Have we got any other quartz? No. Well, maybe we pick some up, but nope. Well, would you look at that? The vacuum cleaner I bought already has a new model out. Oh, nothing's worse than buyer's remorse. I should have held off a little longer. Yeah, but if you did that, you'd be like, well, I should hold on a bit longer, and then I should hold on a bit longer. But you'd, you'd never get to actually buying it. Like, dear, oh dear. I worked as an orbital goods designer up until last year. My daughter found a stable job, and my family's finances are in order, so I decided to do myself a favor and retire. I still enjoy working, but I'd much rather spend time with my family this time off as a recent retiree. I like to check on how Chaco is holding up at work. That's daddy's girl. Sell those ornaments, Chaco. Dad's proud of you. Aww. That's lovely, isn't it? Hello there. Welcome to Genten. Our store has the latest and greatest orbital goods, and we offer after-sales servicing. I'd be happy to answer any questions. Our store has the latest and greatest open goods, and we offer after sales servicing. If you have to answer any questions, Calvert Spy. Whoa! It's that portable terminal I've been hearing all about. Let's see what the price is. That's a whole lot of zeros. I'd never be able to afford something like this on my budget. Yes, yeah, so I imagine new technology like that would be quite expensive. Alright, I'm thinking that we should probably... Let's see if this has changed at all. I doubt it. Bell of Crossbell. This enormous bell was excavated in Crossbell State in S1185. It is estimated to have been forged during the Middle Ages using multiple metal alloys. When struck, it emits a low yet pleasant ring. It is theorized that the bell was created by some influential person of the times, but its true purpose remains shrouded in mystery. Thinking about picking up the quest here first at Imelda, but we'll check the other people first. <laughs> I'm Eris. And I have some fun at our club. Why not spend the day drinking and chatting with me? I've been gaining popularity with our patrons lately. I'm going to gain a lead on my rival and eventually become top hostess. Hey, you guys, free right now? We've got a lot of cute chicks at our club. You want to come in? Coercive barking is an arrestable offense. Keep that in mind. Whoa, 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 whoa! Who said anything about being coercive? And what are you, a cop? Oh, you are. <laughs> My bad. Let's just pretend this didn't happen, eh? Ah, this area is as seedy as ever. <laughs> My bad, My bad. I can give you a sweet deal the next time you come to our place. No thanks. Bribery is also a crime. Uh, you got me there. Dear, oh dear. Welcome. Well, if it isn't Wazzy, I see that book at the end that says COOK on it. It's rare to see you here at a, this time of day. So it is. I'm on a little patrol with my new crew here. The drinks will have to wait until I'm off the clock. I look forward to it. Ever since Ravarch has disappeared, groups once lurking in the shadows have slowly begun to emerge. Which sadly means that the back alley has only gotten worse. Now that it's gone, I feel like I have a better understanding of how much power Ravarch held. 
Alright. Not all the way. Hmm. Pinky Rose. Let's buy a Pinky Rose. Let's buy a Pinky Rose. Day in, day out, I put on a fake smile and pour drinks at the club. Uh, why do I do this to myself? I have been feeling like my job is pointless. At least it pays well. So I don't feel the desire to quit. There's a copy of The Working Man's Diet here. Oh, can we not take it and learn a new recipe? You know, it's a shame there's not a microphone here, because I do a joke. It's very much like I go up there, stand there, and then just play back in my tie. But... There's not a microphone. I can't do the joke. I'm sorry. There needs to be a microphone for that to work. This is the old Revarch compound. Should be totally empty inside now. Hey, you! What are you doing over there? Uh, who are you? <clears throat> I run a real estate agency in Crossbell City. The government gave me custody of this building, and I oversee its management. I'll have to ask that you not enter the premises. It would cause problems. The government gave you custody. I do recall Grandfather mentioning that this would happen. The government wanted to repossess the property quickly because it was owned by the Mafia and too risky to leave alone. Suppose that makes sense. Sorry for the inconvenience, we're with the CPD. We came down this alley as part of our patrol. You're with the police. Oh, my apologies. And thank you for going out of your way to patrol the area. So what brings you here? Were you going to do a routine inspection of the building? Well, we decided to put the property up for sale soon. The whole compound is going to be sold? Yes, many businesses have expressed interest in purchasing it. One said business plans to negotiate today, so I came to meet with them. And there are businesses interested in moving into a building once owned by the Mafia? That can't mean anything good, can it? We're taking that into account, of course. But considering the size of this building, the upkeep costs are astronomical. We have no reason to turn down anyone willing to take it off our hands. You're in the business of selling real estate. It's only natural you do whatever makes you money the fastest. Sure, but I'm sure right about the buyer. No point in staying here, though. We should move on. Yes, let's go. Who's gonna buy it? That's my question. Is it someone we know? Hmm, <laughs> welcome. My, my, look at what the alley cat dragged in. It's the SSS. <laughs> it's been far too long. It's, uh, good to see you too, Imelda. You're as energetic as ever. Hm, so you say. From where I sit, things have been boring as sin lately. Lavarch has been shut down, and you lot have been away on break too. Even my info broker on the Obel Network has closed up shop. An info broker on the Obel Net? She must be referring to Jonah. Went back to the Foundation. Oh, but what's this? I see a couple of unexpected faces with you. Are you supposed to be the SSS's new recruits? A member of the CGF and the leader of a street gang. <laughs> Looks like things are heating up. Wait, how did you... Where did you learn of all of that without your info broker? <laughs> you said I only have one source, my dearies. <laughs> What a fascinating old woman. By the way, I have a little present to give you. Here, take it. That's what we're after. Would this be... <laughs> That's right, Buttergup. It's the key to my lovely downtown property, Maison Imelda. Oh yeah, I remember seeing that name on the side of a dilapidated sh... Hey, it's not dilapidated. In fact, it's so lovely that a swarm of monsters couldn't wait to move in and make it their home. But I suppose you should clean them out. We only came here because you put up an extermination request, you know? I feel like we're just running chores. <laughs> no one's forcing you, but I know you'll do it anyway. Have fun, boys and girls. Yes, we will. 
I'll be watching the new SSS very closely. I look forward to seeing all the fun headlines your team produces. Our division doesn't exist to create entertainment for you, Imelda. <laughs> I was right. You are fascinating. Do your best to entertain me, dearies. Although I should check her shop. Running out of money there very quickly. And I don't think I'd be able to get these, even though I'd want them. But no. But no. Alright, so I am thinking that we continue our rounds in the next part. This is a nice stopping point before we head off to the next area and see what's going on there before we head off towards that extermination request. And then we'll carry on doing the rounds and then head out and get the other ones sorted. Where's our like, chapter one here? Because it's like, I want to leave those two. I mean, that's why I wasn't speaking to Wendy. So I want to get that one done. So we'll head towards that. And then we'll obviously do the rounds everywhere we can. And then head off to West Crossbell Highway, Monster Extermination. And then we'll come back and do these. Obviously. So we'll see you in the next part anyway. Ta-ta. For now.